Kids for All is a wonderful program whose primary goal is to provide children in historically disadvantaged communities with the opportunity for enjoyment, empowerment, and promotion of self-esteem through the medium of dance. The program also trains professional dancers and develops a unique indigenous dance community. Dance for All is based in Athlone, Cape Town and has been in operation for 20 years. It offers classes and various forms of dance to thousands of children from all over South Africa, including service points in surrounding townships of Guguletu, Nyanga, Kayalicha and Nanga. This outreach program helps children in these areas develop a sense of drive and empowerment. By providing an enjoyable and constructive outlet, Dance for All gives students the chance to spend their afternoons in a safe environment while learning valuable dance skills. The students develop important life skills such as discipline, confidence, and positive self-esteem. This helps them set their goals for the future. Only 10 women in the world have ever been awarded the Prima Ballerina a Saluta, the highest honor any ballerina can receive. One winner was Phyllis Spira. She and her husband founded Dance for All in 1991. At the time, it looked as if the program would not succeed. Phyllis endured a lot of criticism for opening a project in a relatively underprivileged area. However, today the program has grown and has now taught over 1,500 children classical ballet as well as other dance disciplines. Sadly, in 2008, Phyllis Spira passed away at the ripe age of 64. Her mesmerizing grace on stage and dedication to her students is missed worldwide. Her husband, Philip, spoke of how Phyllis believed her students' background should never be a reason for compromising quality, and that motto, Dance for All, still lives by today. Dance for All teaches African contemporary, ballet, jazz, musical theatre, and much more. Teachers vary from volunteers to well-known choreographers from all over the world. In July of 2011, they completed their LEAP Winter Dance Intensive. This program ran for two weeks and was facilitated by six professional dancers from the United States. These dancers paid out of their own pockets to come to teach these kids in the LEAP program. After two weeks of intensive training, they performed on stage for the local community. It's a great opportunity for us to get out into the community and, and especially a different country and see how things work and also help, you know, help the kids that wouldn't otherwise have an opportunity to yeah. They received a Platinum Impumadelo Social Innovations Award in February of 2007 and made history by becoming the first arts and culture project to win this award. By now, we sort of like sisters because and I have brothers. <laughs> we see each other every day and then we talk to each other. We share what we want to share. Yeah, we have fights. Yes. We have one. But then we, we normally sort of Stage to me, and then you know the smiles, the wild, crazy dances we do. 